we could just sit here. We actually found where it struck. It blew a tree completely apart. Okay, you guys, look at this. The storm is just moving over the city. They did too, and then it ended up being a plot hopper. Ayo! 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 Good morning. Good morning. So where are we headed off to this morning? Swim. Yeah, summer swim, huh? Exciting. It's been months since you've been with your swim buddies, huh? Are you excited to see some old faces? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then next month you get to see like your swim bestie, right? Mm -hmm. She's not gonna be there this month, but she'll be there next month. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Let's go swim. Well, you're swimming. I'm not. <laughs> well, we could just sit here. All right, we are back home. Well, we've been back home. I, uh, we ended up stopping at the library. We had to return some books there. And then, um, I, oh, my mail's here. Good. I can go check it. Um, and then we also had to stop by Walmart. I need to get Aspen a new headset because Guyana had broke his. Anyway, um, look, I wanted to show you what I did. Aren't they cute? Here, maybe I'll get a close up on him. Isn't he cute? Then I've got one there. And then I did the windows. And I've got a few other things to put out. But that was my little bit of 4th of July stuff that I put out. I just thought those were super cute. Matt and I are gonna be going to look at a bed today because we are in desperate, desperate need of a new bed. Right now I'm trying to tackle some dishes which I am seriously behind on. So I'm gonna do that right now and then we'll see how much time we have before we have to take Ireland to Anne Braxton to work. Okay, so we're back in Dubuque today and we decided to drive through the area that the lightning struck right in front of us. So when we were watching the video back and even while we were experiencing it, it seemed like it struck to the right of us, didn't it? Yeah. It, it seemed like it just leapt over the highway and struck over by these houses to the right. But we actually found where it struck. It blew a tree completely apart. So if we get a chance to go back that way, I will definitely show you guys. But yeah, it, when they say never stand under a tree during a thunderstorm, there's a reason they tell you not to. And that tree is evidence of why. Good gravy. Okay guys, I'm not sure. I'm not sure we're not gonna end up in a storm again. Check out this sky. <coughs> it's 5.36 at night. And look, next to Matt. Look out there. I know, that's what I was showing him. Look how dark it is. Over here, nice and bright, sunny. Over there, nice and dark. Stormy. What the heck? Now look at this. There's another ugly cloud mass. Not near as low though. No, it's not as low as the last one, but then again, we'll just kind of have to wait and see. And then look at this. Look how bright it is over there. Look at that again. And look, can you see how it's like shelf? Do it quick. Well, there's cars. Oh. Okay, you guys, can you see how it's shelving up over there too? Look at that. Oh my goodness. It is so dark. Deep. Now the sun's just gone. It is so dark. Oh 
Oh, look. Look over there. You can see the break in the stormy sky. It's crazy. Okay, you guys, look at... We pulled over for a minute, and the, the air has gotten so much. The air has gotten so much cooler than what it was. Look at that. Look at that. That storm's definitely moved in, you guys. Matt, Matt was like, so we just went to go to a restaurant. There's a really good restaurant here called A&W. But yesterday, <laughs> yesterday the storm was so heavy that uh, it put their sub pump out. And Matt just saw some My kid. Okay, you guys, look at this. The storm is just moving over the city. summer is anymore Zane says it's hard to know what it's gonna do because it looks it's, it's just so a hot. small intense area of storm and then look at down there beautiful that's how the yes yeah the yesterday the yesterday the one yesterday did too and then it yeah. ended up being a clod hopper <laughs> clod hopper is that the new technical term for the scary storms I think this one's all show. I mean, it looks terrible, but it's really quiet so far. A few lightning strikes, but I shouldn't say anything because, you know, that's that's how that stuff happens. Look at that. The last time y'all did that, the city started flooding. <laughs> He's not wrong. The city almost went You guys saw it. Yeah, it's right above us. So, yeah, there's not much, I mean, really, there's not much activity going on. There's not hardly any wind. It's kind of hard to know what it's going to do. Okay, so the wind's just slightly starting to pick up, so we'll see. I don't know. I don't know if it's going to be anything like yesterday. Let's hope not, because there's still a lot of people recovering from what that storm did. Wind's picking up. But yeah, it's definitely picking up again. As it's moving through, so 